going to show you my favorite, one of my most favorite glove knives of all. It's the perfect EDC knife. It, it excels in every area. I love it, and it, even though there's some history behind it, but let's, I'll say that later. But that's my Blackjack Brunt. Alright, made in Seki, Japan. Uh, and I got this, this, this is original, like from the 90s one. It's, it's so sharp, it's such a great everyday carry. I carry it usually like, like this, either like this, I put the, the stud in. You know, so I can just come out like that, or I can put it on the belt, or really ideally is in reverse grip. But I want to show a couple of things in comparison with the bigger versus the smaller. So right now I'm going to do the 10 angles of attack with the Bowie knife, right, with my trainers. much faster right it's smaller so it, what it loses in reach you gain in speed and, and again it's how you, you use the glove so as I like I said the daylight is really going and that's bugging me so I want to do some things on the thrusting post and some of these are uh, these are just all offensive shots. One hit, you know, offensive to go first. So I'm gonna start with the, the grunt. Start with a snap cut. Look at that. That's a slice it from here to there. back cut, does it, and you know, slower motion, snap cut, you just fire that out there, boom, your head's back, whipping, wham, wham, you fake them out, mm. okay, um, your straight thrusts, you know, you gotta hit things and feel the vibration in your, in your wrist. Or reverse grip, which reverse grip is ideal for close quarter. They're running out of light. I can feel it. Damn it. Now I'm gonna hit this with a snap cut. Right from here. I'm ready. See, and you're coming in, you're protected, you're springing in. And you're going, your goal is this part of the blade to go to this part of the skull, right in the center. Before it even starts, you leap over his guard, pop it, pop it right there. Not lethal. And it creates a lot of blood, and you'd be good. All right, so that's that's a snap cut, and that's not even all with my power. You know, it's like 50, not even 50 percent. Okay, but you got to come out and practice hitting them. <coughs> oh. <laughs> Get some back cuts. Practice. So it's just like no different than <coughs> you know a boxer or someone practicing in the gym on a bag, or you know, for a fight or just for training. You should just from there working that same jab over and over, the cross, the cut, and then the combinations. Same thing with the, with these techniques. Now the back. Cut. I 
the back cut comes over. My target comes at my my arm, my weapon rearing arm. Target makes an attack at that. I pop over and then simultaneously hit him. Boom. It's one of the beautiful things about the back cut. Say if I was to, from knowing the, the six count missing, if say if I missed one, come right back where I'm there and get another one. Um, oh yes, also the number three line is a great line, great, great, great line to start and end something. You know, it, it, if you really have to, <coughs> sorry. All right, the number three line, real quick. Again, it's running out of light. Fuck. The number three line. Okay. Here, I'll, here's my six count drill. One, two, three, four, five, six. Step to the knife. Six. Okay. So here, number one, line number one, the most basic and when you use the most. Okay, it can be regular, it can be wide, it can be tight. Okay, but that's number one. Number two, turn the wrist over, come across horizontal. Number three, turn it here, come across. Four, windshield. Five, roll it on the outside. Six, bludgeon them with that. Okay, so you see the number three line. So envision this, my target, Right, okay, most people, whatever, <laughs> untrue, you know, stupid shit anyway, but let's just say, so instead of throwing a traditional initiate attack, you know, either snap, cut forward, or a number one, or something. Of this motion, anything of this motion, which 99.9% .9 everyone throws. All right, first, the number three is going to come out of nowhere, right from the side, and just take take whatever out. You know, it's just like that. It's a sorry, you know. All right, so instead of that typical, all right, last when I'm ready, I'm going to just turn my spine over because the back cut you're hitting with the tip. And then you're ripping with your false edge, your real edge, whatever you have, if they both work. So the number three is going there. So in slow motion, I'm here. All right, and when I'm ready, I, and that whips around. I'm not ready for that. You know, and you can, you can take the stomach, you can take the elbows, the arms, <laughs> if you don't want to be lethal, you know, you can raise it up a little bit and bat the arms. That's a great one too. So the target's there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mm. Right? You're not going to pick up on it in time. And if they do, it doesn't matter. It's still too late. And with the, and with the three, the last thing with the three, you know, you can throw it just horizontal from where you're at here. You can go low. Is that? fantastic way too to get the first beat coming in and then you just come in low and you're sweet or you can go in low with your edge sweep the legs out number three or you can go high tippy top toes up oh, and come down and come down on them like throw a back cut the, block, the uh, one that a real nasty good one but you throw it up high into the targets blind area blind spot and then you rip it down across the face coming down and they don't realize it until they've been hit yeah. and then what I wanted to get to earlier today but didn't hope this looks like going to do a lot of double bowie stuff today and, and do the sets.
Let's see, I'm wrapping this up, man. I'm fucking out of time. That'd be a good sport, though. We'll see, uh, we'll see what it looks like back there, but it's just kind of a little demonstration of, you know, some of the things you could take things together and come out and have a little workout on your own with the, the knife, really a real one, a workout where you actually sweat and, and push and you'll be rewarded for it. Okay, Jason out.